get hey just doing a bit of LS tech. We're doing a cam on this um, uh, VE L77, and being a L77, it's got DOD displacement on demand, or referred to as AFM, active fuel management. Now on these in the sump, they got this valve here, which is a basically a pressure relief valve because uh, the pumps actually pump quite a lot of oil so to pump the lifters up which drops the cylinders out um, and then when you're not in like when you're not in four cylinder mode and you're in eight cylinder mode the pumps are pumping too much oil so then this basically pops open and bleeds any excess oil out of the sump um, so with putting a cam in it we're changing the oil pump removing the AFM DOD uh, lifters and so on and I will remove this valve and then screw a plug into it so it cannot drop the oil pressure out because that, that limits your oil pressure to I think it's about 55 to 60 psi uh, once it hits that that starts dumping your oil back into the sump so yeah that will get removed after the lifters yeah. You see the AFM lifters are well someone's out maybe there making some noise. Um see in there there are these long things that go there we go. There's long critters. Got this hole here. The valve in this plate here, the solenoid, this plate here, opens up, pumps heap extra oil in here and pumps these lifters up and opens the valves, both exhaust and inlet valve on that cylinder. You put a cam on these without removing them, the lifter will fail. That's good. Compare that to you. Standard lifter, AFM lifter or DOD lifter, whichever you prefer to call it. Yeah, well, there you go. So, if you're ever doing that, like a lot of shops will leave that in there and even leave the AFM pump in. Um, and you can do that. It's just your oil pressure is limited. And if that ever valve ever fails, gets stuck open, you're just going to lose oil pressure. So, I like to remove them and change the pump to a normal... Uh, I put a Mellings pump in. Anyway, she's all part. Time to get it back together.